guys, it's me, Ursula Thomas, and welcome back to my channel. Yes, guys, it's me. I'm going to tell y'all, I thought about it once I logged off uh, the last video. I was like, I just go ahead, need to go ahead on and make the other another video and just put it back because if I don't, uh, by the time I move, I won't know where none of this stuff at. I won't know where none of it is at. So this is going to be a long video because y'all remember I went thrifting out of town. I went to Jasper. I was try. I was say Jasper, Tennessee. I went to Jasper, Alabama, and then we went to Birmingham. And so I'm not gonna prolong because it's always a little H and M. Remember I told y'all I went to H and M, so a little of that is thrown up in there. So we finna just go and get into it. All right, let's do it. All of my old subbies that been down with me. Woo! All my new subbies, woo, 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 woo. thank you for joining the family and all the passerby say, who is that, who is that, who is that? I am Ursula Thomas, honey, yes, I'm Ursula Thomas, and yes, I ain't going to lie, I'm sipping on the, on, on, the, on the gold, honey, sipping on the, sipping on it. Okay, let's get into it, y'all. So, I can't remember what I showed y'all, what I haven't showed y'all, but hey, like I say all the time, if you seen it before, just, uh... And like you had and be like, oh, okay. We're going to start with this dress. Y'all, I absolutely love this dress. I'm going to stand up so you can see it. It's just nothing spectacular. It does have pockets. But, y'all, I use this dress for everything. It's a house dress. It's an errand dress. It's a knock around. It's, I love it. It's so comfortable. I wore it to the eye doctor. Just slipped some biker shorts, some leopard print biker shorts on under it. Honey, I was gone. Do you hear me? So, I want to jump into it. Let's go ahead and get started. I cannot remember what I showed y'all and what I hadn't showed y'all. So, we're going to start with the thrifted items first. And I feel like I showed y'all guys this, but it's all packed up together, so I could remember. But, like I said, if you've seen it before, just act like you haven't. But, it's this little number here, this little frilly number. She's so cute. She is see-through, but she'll be cute with a uh, little sum under it. Next, I got this. I already know how I want to do this. So, it's definitely vintage. And I'm going to tell you what I had to do. I don't mind. That's the thing about thrifting, y'all. I don't mind altering a few little things if I have to. Uh, what I did was cut the sleeves out. I cut the sleeves out. And I'm just going to take this. Get that no sewing. Or even if I had to sew it, just fold and just sew just a little bit of it like that. And I want to put a collar shirt on with it, but... Y'all know, I had one like this before. I still got it, but I like this one also, and it does have pocket. It's definitely vintage, so I grabbed that. Next, I got just this little rib knit. It's so soft and so comfortable. Just, I just thought about something because I did have a yard sale piece I want to show you guys. But anyway, I just got this little rib knit, rib knit, rib knit little pull on sweater black next i got i don't know why i feel like i've shown y'all this but like i said you seen just like you have it this little number here i thought that would be nice then i got these which i think because honey day is tight but y'all know i go to a train and i you know when i first started i used to uh exercise me and my husband six to seven days a week then when the pandemic hit we start slowing down child so now i got a trainer i'm building myself back up i go to my trainer supposed to be three times a week <laughs> hey but like i said on saturdays uh that's one of my training days that's normally the day me and my husband get now sometimes we will train together but uh yeah i think these would be so cute with some boots okay and what else? I feel like everything else I pretty much showed you guys. I really do. I feel like I showed you guys. So let's get into H and M. I want to do H and M. H and M because it's not a lot. So, y'all, I just popped in there just to pop in. I didn't even know they was having like a major sale. But pretty much what y'all saw my husband hold up is pretty much what I got. They was having an awesome, awesome sale. So... I ended up getting this little number here, and I really thought about 
getting two or two, three of them, but I had to control myself. It was just $7.99, regular price, $30. I feel for whoever paid $30 for it. I'm just a bargain, honey, and me just won't let me do it. But I love this green and black, and I ordered some high-top comeback boots from Amazon that I'm aware with this that I think is going to be gorgeous. And even though it is, to me, it's very fall. And you can even turn it into winter. Just throw your blaze on and some boots and some tights under it. So I grabbed that, and I love the, uh, y'all know I love anything with frilly frilly at the bottom. Next thing I grabbed was this. Now, this is a little thinner. But I promise you, you could lay on. I'm sorry, y'all. I can't try this stuff on right now. But I promise you guys, as soon as I move and get settled, we will start back child trying on and, and styling and everything. I did get this one. And I know this ain't everybody thing. Got the frilly frilly. It's real long. Well, it's real long on me. That's the sleeves. But the colors just scream fall to me. That black and gold with that little pop of like hot pink it's real long so i did get that one and this one guys was only $8.99 regular price $34.99 next i got this little shirt dress if they didn't have it in my size so i just grabbed the size that they had it in so even though it fits i'm sure it's supposed to fit like bigger but it's just this little leopard print shirt dress and I had to get it in the size they had. And it fit. But if I could have been able to get it in my size, it would have been really, really loose. But that's okay. Because I can wear it by itself. I can wear it with some leggings, some tights, or whatever. And this regular price on this was $20. I ended up getting it for $6.99. Ooh. So, yeah. Then, the last dress that I got, which... They did not have it in my size, so I had to go up two sizes, and I don't know. I just didn't want to leave. To me, it make me look a little granny, but I just didn't want to leave it. I just love the green and that pink, and look at that. Look at the greens and the pink. It looks springy. Look at those sleeves. It's big on me. And what I think I'm going to do is take a green scarf and, like, tie it as a belt. It's real long. I'm going to work it out. But I just, I thought it was so pretty and I could not leave it. The regular price on this one was $34.99 and I got that for $6.99. Y'all, they was having a chat. They said it was at the whim. Do you hear me? And then if you was a reward member, you got extra off. And the last two items I got, no, it's three. I had a pink sweater. I don't know what I did with the pink sweater. It's these. These, I'm then going to stay on my journey. Because, honey, these, like, you know how I skin on the peach? You bet, child. But they are so pretty. They are so pretty. And the regular price on these was $34. These was $13.99. They are so pretty, y'all. And let's see. And lastly, I'm definitely, definitely got to lose some to get up in these. These were $10.99. Regular price was $34.99. Look at those. Yes. They are so pretty. Okay, so that's the H&M. Now, of course, y'all know I thrifted. I went to American Thrift. And where else did I go? I can't remember. But let's get into it. Okay. I'm going to start with this. Now, I know this is not everybody thing. But, y'all, I told y'all how I have to see. It would smell so good. It smell like down. I told y'all how I how my brain worked. If I the minute I see it, and that be my problem. If I see it styled in my head, it's nine times ten coming home with me. When I saw this, I saw look at that. Oh, the color. I just saw four leather. I saw a black blouse, 
collar blouse all the way up, right? And then I saw the collar coming out, and then I saw a big black uh, bow hanging over it with some faux leather pants and my Nine West boots. The color, the color. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Yes, and this came, this was thrifty. This is a little bargain bun because I threw a little bargain bun in here too. I got this. Now, I ain't, I don't ride nothing, but it said live to ride, ride to live. Only reason I got it is because Popeye was on it. And I thought styled up with a blazer would be too cute. Look at Popeye. Yeah, I used to love me some Popeye. I didn't like spinach back then, but I used to love me some Popeye. I couldn't stand olive oil. She was just, olive oil, I just couldn't stand olive oil. I was like, olive oil. <laughs> She just, she was stick. And I was like, why they got olive oil? I've always been hip to y'all. I was like, well, I ain't never been dense to me, but I've been hip to I was like, why olive oil so little? <laughs> then I got this, and I'm going to tell y'all why. Uh, Chai, I told y'all I was thinking about doing an Amazon and a Walmart uh, workout haul. If y'all want to see that, just let me know. There was one person I don't think responded, but that's the majority, so I'm going to do it. <laughs> so anyway... I ordered some, I got three items of workout from Amazon. Two of them got to come. And I got one, one from Walmart. I think I'm about two more from Walmart. And I'm sure cause, like I said, I go to a trainer and he, honey, he trains. So you got to jump, move. And the black ones I wore from Walmart, baby, they didn't roll. They didn't do nothing. They was, so I got to try the Amazons and let y'all know. Anyway, one of them that I ordered from Amazon is a two-piece. It, it is leopard print, and I want to wear it like if I'm running errands, and I want to throw this on before it gets too cold in my boots. So I thought this would be perfect, and plus, I just love that mustard color. Then we got this, y'all. Y'all know I couldn't leave this. Look at Pac and Poetic Justice, and they used to be one of my daughter's favorite movies. But anyway, I just got that because... Like I said, I love tees like that. Y'all know I love t-shirts, and I love to style them up. Next, I got these right here. And I got these because I saw this with a collar shirt, a vest, and my comeback boots. And I think that would be nice. Now, they are thin, so if I don't get to wear them real soon, well, I can put tights on them. Um, and this just came with its own um, red belt. Next, I got this. This is... Just a jumper, but what sold me on it is, I'm going to show y'all as soon as, I should already have this out. But anyway, if you look at the sleeves, if I can, come on now. This is, y'all see them? And this part is sheer, and it's just, and it, other than that, it was just the sleeves that really sold me on, and the color, and then she had those, that look. We used to call it fake crease and go all the way down and long. Now it fit feet. So I'm definitely going to have to put some shape well, something on under it and a cover over it. I grab these. I love these. I love these. And this stuff was from Goodwill, out of town Goodwill. I love it. When I saw my husband was looking like, I was like, I don't know why, but I love these. I just, when I seen these jeans, I was just like, oh, I want those. So I hope they're my size. I love them. And I just saw them with just a sweater and some boots or some gym shoes. I don't know why. I just love the floral print on them. I just love them when I saw them. So I grabbed those. Then I grabbed this, and I feel like I always gravitate to shirts like this that have any type of little detail. And it just had the little sleeves like that, and it sleeves tie, and it's just striped, and it was new with tags. Of, co of course, you know, I've washed it. Then I grabbed these, and these are just some cargo pants. I'm not crazy about the material. The material is definitely polyester, but I think blue, blue. Yeah, I do like blue, but I think brown and black is so, I don't know, I just love brown and black. So I grabbed these, and they are cargo no pockets in it. Well, they four pockets in the back. But I'm not crazy about the material. But I did grab those. And then, of course, this is why it's hard for me to go to a store. Or, like, when I went to H&M. Because I said, H&M. What's wrong with me? H&M. Uh, I did see somebody at the hall what they called a jacket. 
I went in there and looked at that thing. That thing was seventy or eighty dollars. I can't remember. I was like, no, no, the bargain in me just won't let me do it. But I did get this, and I love them. It's so soft. I done wore this. I know about five or six times. I wore it with a tank and some leggings from Walmart. And then because this dress was so comfortable, when I ran across this black one like this, of course I got it. And the, in, the one I have on looked just like this. It's identical, except this one's black. Oh, they are so comfortable. And even if you just want to throw on some uh, black leggings, black Uggs, or whatever, just quick air. Now, it's thin, but it's comfortable. Then I grabbed these. And these are, who these are just some Kato's. But I love the pattern on them. Look at that pattern. Yeah, so I grabbed these. And I think they'll be cute with a collar shirt or a sweater. And they just got those little pockets in the back. Then I grabbed these. Now, these just are some Walmart. I knew they was time and true. Uh, I knew that they was going to... Uh, flood on me because I knew my if you hipped it you already know I knew my butt and my hips was going to pull them up and they already short so like if I didn't have so much butt and hip they probably be fine but because I have butt and hip they uh and tummy just a just a tad of tummy <laughs> can't leave that out uh they come up but most of my hips and my butt so but I thought even with my comeback boots I have some short comeback boots but yeah i thought even just if i put them in my boots or if i just wear them with my comeback boots and a collar shirt or a sweater i still thought they would be nice then i got this and this is just a i think somebody made it because i didn't see no tag but i liked it i wish they'd put uh pockets on it but they didn't but she's definitely a winter piece and i'm definitely gonna wear her i might put a collar shirt on under her fold a collar shirt and then make my own pussy bow blouse and I'm definitely going to wear my comeback boots with her. But I could really, I really could show you how to dress that up. That would be just as cute. Now, I know. Let me go ahead and show this. I did get this. And I know some people are like, what the what? But I don't know if y'all remember. But I got that vest. And y'all know vests are all the right this year. I got that gold-like mustard vest that I thought throwed over this with some leather pants. Or, you know, faux leather pants would be so cute. So, I grabbed that. Plus, y'all know I love color. Now, I know y'all going to be like, girl, trust your girl. Trust me. When I saw this, I was like, okay. I have had something so similar to this. Every time I pretty much showed it, somebody bought it from me. But this is in a coat form or lightweight jacket. Now, it screams fall. I think this was like $4.99. This screams fall. Now, I got this from American Thrift. Look at that. Now, to tone it down, and I got this from the bargain bone. Just imagine. It's definitely vintage. Just put this on under this. Y'all sound for me to do some style video. Put this on under this. And if you got a cream boot... Or you can do your black boot. Or you can smash it out with a red boot. I hope y'all can see it. See how they just turn it down? And don't have a, a a chain belt because the buttons. Look at the button. So you can have a gold chain belt and let it hang with some sharp boots. I'm telling you, they, if Gucci or somebody came out with something like this, child, you wouldn't be able to. I will, because I was like, hey, that's a different story. We ain't even finna stop right there. Then I got this number right here. I love the throwing stuff like this with blazers. I, I'll definitely have to wear some on under because it's thin and real loose. And I don't want to be shaking baking everywhere. I don't want to be just shaking baking everywhere. So I definitely have to put some good, good undies on with stuff like that. Now, y'all, we getting down to the nitty gritty. Got to take a breath. I know we in it, but I got to take a breath. You guys. You guys. Yes, I say you guys. Let's, let's. Y'all. I know she ain't everybody. But honey, hush your mouth and don't look no more. She was $6.99. She's dead. Oh, I can tell you right here. I lied, y'all. She was $12. I thought she was $6.99. She's a Jonathan Michaels. But she long, honey, and all I seen was a black fedora 
with all black and my Purdue. What is it? My calling it right? Honey, yes. Yeah, I had to get it. I had to. That was the first one. Now, I do have another red coat, but I'm going to have to let that one go. Because she right here, and she was $13.99. Lady Suzette. Lady Suzette. Honey, Lady Suzette. When I tried Lady Suzette on, Lady Suzette was $13.99. But you know what? When I tried Lady Suzette on, it wasn't no leaving her. The detail. First, that's why I like vintage. Because the only thing they're doing now is going back snatching with the exaggerated uh, uh, shows. Look at this. Look at the detail in the back. Y'all see this? And then the front. Honey. And then on the. And when I put her on my hood, I'm like, you got to get that. He was like, you look too good. And he didn't tell me. You think he didn't Honey, yes. Then I got this little number. I said I was going to look it up because it just seemed like she just something else by herself. Look at the structure of it. Is that not? Look at this. Child, look. Okay. Last but not least, in the coat, this was $8 Marona. And look at that. Look at that. Look at the buttons, y'all. I think this, I, no, just Marona. I spent a lot. Y'all see this? Pockets ain't been old. I guess somebody got them and was like, I don't like that. Then, last but not least, is this little polka dot, uh, wait a minute, I got some hanging on it, a shirt. But it's a polka dot dress. And, it, and I don't, I'm not a big high-low fan, but the thing I like about this is the high is real low. So the low part is almost like a tail. And it's polka dot. And I know somebody, but, oh, that's kind of summer and springy. Put you some leggings on, Andre. Put you some uh, booties on, Andre with a black turtleneck or a collar shirt or jazz it up with other kind of shirt. Or you can uh, button it up and layer something on top of it. So I did get that. And then the last but not least is this blouse. See, I really liked it, this. I like the detail. It almost looked like a little western with, with the details around it. Got shoulder pads. It looked western-y. But it's so good, y'all. I don't, it's by somebody called Dessert Diva, something like that, by Cheryl Halt. But the book, it, it snaps. She snaps. She definitely look Western, Western-like. That's the back. I know it's, y'all see that? And then this the sleeve. But even on the sleeves and the collar, I'm show y'all. It has detail. Y'all see that detail? And that's it. That's my H&M. That's my American Thrill. My dog and bond. All thrown into one. I know this has been a journey. I thank y'all for the journey. That's my coffee. Let me know that it's finna turn off. It ain't keeping warm no more. That's fine. I haven't had enough. So anyway, with that being said, y'all already know. Go out and vote <laughs> and be the solution to somebody's problem. I love you guys. Bye. Be the. If y'all want to see a little sneak peek of my training, let me know. Y'all know all, if I get one person say, yeah, that's majority. That, if I get one person say, yeah, don't nobody say nothing, that's majority. Y'all y'all know. So anyway, if y'all want to see a little sneak peek of my workout, y'all just let me know. And I will show you guys. Of some of the stuff I do with my training. Okay? Okay, I love you guys. Bye. Be the so Okay, let me go because I know this one was long. Okay, I think it's going to click.